Hey everyone, I'm Eitan. And I'm Noor. And we're the Two Nice Jewish Boys from the Two Nice Jewish Boys podcast. And today we're here to react to Palestinian television clips from Gaza and the West Bank. Yep. Uh, we all love uh, children TV shows. What What's your favorite, by the way? I, I like Reading Rainbow. Oh. Yeah. Oh. What about you? Uh, Bernie the Dinosaur. Well, we'll see what the Palestinian kids uh, like to watch on TV. Yeah. Uh, we're going to see some bits. Basically, we found this YouTube channel called Palestinian Media Watch, and it's got some real gems. It's got uh, basically videos of, you know, uh, news reports and kids shows and uh, social fun. media posts yeah. coming out of the West Bank and out of Gaza, and we're going to react to some of them. Yeah. Let's go. Let's so, do this. you know, just... Uh, browsing here, the first thing that pops is this video called Stabbing for Kids, Palestinian Girl Gives Demo. <laughs> demo. No. Wow. This is... And uh, you gotta love the thumbnail, right? Stab, 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 stab. Wow. Okay. Okay. Well, this, That's this pretty promising. Clickbaity. Yeah. <laughs> فوفو ايش بتقولي لشباب الضفة؟ اطعم 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 What the beep <laughs> Obviously this girl, this poor little girl is innocent I mean she's a child God help us um, But how vile of a human being do you have to be to, to, to film a girl and tell your girl to say teach your girl to say these things and then film her doing such violent uh, things and saying such violent things like yeah those are the peaceful people we're I don't supposed know, this to is gonna uh, be like a fun reaction <laughs> video man <laughs> let's turn dark really maybe quick. it'll get better maybe we'll find like peaceful more peaceful content hamas tv teaches kids to kill jews well there goes your <laughs> hope <laughs> Uh, oh man. I like how the girl tried to be like sensible. She's like, we don't want to do anything to them. We just want to get them out of our land and go back. He's like, what are you talking about? We want to slaughter them. All of them. Yeah, she was probably executed for saying that. Oh, God. And now she's like, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, of course we want to slaughter. Well, at least we have the option to resist peacefully uh, before they slaughter us all. Yeah. But I love how he... It doesn't seem like the teddy bear is too committed to the peaceful option. He's like, yes, yes, we offer peace, but then we slaughter them. We slaughter them. And you gotta love the, the, the movement of the knife. Like, yeah. It's very professional. It's, it's a special ops teddy bear. Yeah. Special ops teddy bear. Kids on Hamas TV, we want to die as martyrs. That's... Exciting. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I Promising. Mean, I want to be an astronaut, but yeah, it's just me. It's just not gonna happen. I think it's more likely for them. فأغلب هؤلاء الأطفال باتت المقاومة بالنسبة لهم حلما يراودهم ما أن تتحدث إليهم حتى تتفاجأ من قوة وبلاغة منطقهم. منحب المقاومة ونحب الموت شودا تهيا شودا. الاحتلال الإسرائيلي بيروح شلة بالمقاومة إحنا دائما بنحب المقاومة عشان نحقق شعبنا فلسطين وعنا إحنا بنحب الشهداء ونحي وزاكفر الشهداء الأجواء العامة في المخيم مفعمة بروح المقاومة ومن سطر بطولاتها أغلب الجدران تطالع Just check out the sign right in the, yeah. in, the, in the Palestinian city So that's what the kids see every day when they go to school Like jihadists baby killers uh, posing with guns yeah and i want to go back to that what we just saw for yeah. a second because if you think about it that's not something that you just i don't know you tell a kid to recite right now and you recite like yeah that genuine. recitation is from like 
you know rote memory it's like it's like the indoctrination like day after day after day they're saying these things in school at home so that's how that kid remembers that whole that whole speech yeah, about, narrative you know martyrs and uh praise the martyrs and all those phrases i mean that's right. not something that a kid just comes up with on that's his own what they teach them in the school system funded by the european union and this um, is the this is the heart of the conflict guys this is exactly the problem that it's not you know uh that israel is doing something so awful that causes these people to then have to respond in a certain way well, something it's, we can do to change something yeah it's 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 generational indoctrination they're teaching their kids just awful awful things it's, it's really i mean it's terrifying and i mean we're laughing at this because you know what can you do but laugh right that's like jewish culture is so you laugh at the most difficult tragic stuff but it really is tragic it's tragic that these kids it's abuse in my eyes it's child yeah. abuse i mean we'll be fine you know we prosper in front of us is gorgeous tel aviv we live like life to the fullest they will suffer for generations to come because they refuse to accept reality. But let's and see they, how this... they refuse to educate their kids on like good, the positive values. Yeah, they're being indoctrinated. It's just awful. Let's It's see how this uh, TV piece ends. <laughs> المقاومة مقاومة في السلاح هي اللي بتجيب النتيجة في في مخيم جنين ويظل مخيم جنين يربي أبنائه على المقاومة ويسلمهم الراية جيلا بعد جيل وعيونهم ترنو لإحدى الحسنيين إما العودة إلى ديارهم المحتلة أو الشهادة So those are basically the two options they have, right? The Palestinians. That's how they see the world. Either they return to the occupied lands, meaning we are, the Jews here are either dead or expelled, or they go and kill themselves and killing us. So for us, it's a pretty much lose-lose situation, it's one so, might say. It's so meta, by the way, speaking of, you know, Zuckerberg, he hit it on the, he hit the nail on the head. It's so meta. They, they, um... Uh, like the whole report is about uh is about like the culture of violence that they have but also the report itself is promoting a culture of violence yep like the reporter himself is talking about it in this way that's like they yearn right yeah let's see something nicer <laughs> get out from this Hamas, the kids <laughs> shoot all the Jews. Yeah, let's slide oh, things great. up a little bit all right <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> اه طبعا الجيران اليهوديين عندي يقبش عليهم لو كانوا يهود يعني جيرانه او صهاينه عادي طيب دين ليش حابه تصير شرطيه ليش زي مين زي عمه مين عمه احمد هو شرطي شو بيسوي طب الشرطي بس الحرامي والبيعمل مشاكل وبطخ اليهود صح انت بديك تصيري زيه ان شاء الله لما تكبري لما تخلي اليهود كلهم 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 اه طيب Ah, that's a little Hitler right there. Ah. <laughs> what a little cute Hitler! Ah, what? It's kids indoctrinating kids. It's like they the the machine is so well oiled that they don't even need the yeah. they don't need an adult in the room anymore. No, ah. even the the bee is actually the the good guy here in the story, right? Because yeah. the the bee is like you want to catch thieves, right? Yeah, and she's, <laughs> and like, she's like, like kill no, Jews. I'd rather kill all Jews if if I have the options. Oh my God. How do people, you know what's what's devastating is that we uh, were searching for this channel and the first thing to pop up is like BBC, uh, right? BBC and uh, Reuters and Al Jazeera articles about how Israel is killing Gazan babies and basically blood libels. And these videos that are like, this should be headlines. 
if the, if Israel had a children's show saying with one kid telling another kid uh, kill the kill the Palestinians and then the kid was saying yes and you say all the Palestinians kill all the Palestinians oh that would make headlines that would make global headlines that would be headlines around the world there's only 300,000 views on this video. Yeah. That's, that's like, that's not even all the Jews. And that's because uh, the Western world is racist. And if Palestine, if Arabs basically uh, say such things, it's acceptable because they're Arabs, right? Unbelievable. Okay, let's see what else, what, what other treasures do we have on this channel? Do we have here? Um, Palestinian kids erase Israel, say Nazareth is an occupied Palestinian city. مدينة النصرة هي مدينة فلسطينية محتلة من عام 1948 هي تقع في شمال فلسطين فيها مجموعة من الكنائس ومنها أهم الكنائس كنيسة البشارة بشرت سيد مريم عليه بسيدنا عيسى هي مدينة فلسطينية محتلة مدينة محتلة من 48 مدينة فلسطينية محتلة فيها كنائس كتير مدينة الناصرة هي مدينة في فلسطين المحتلة هي بتكون شمالات لفلسطين. So as you can see, the narrative of occupation, even of cities that are clearly in Israeli territory, that aren't even disputed territories, they're not controversial. Nazareth is like deep in Israeli territory. Even that, they're teaching their kids this is an occupied city. All of Israel is occupied. Guys, it's a lie. They don't want the West Bank. They don't want Gaza. We gave them Gaza. They don't want that. They want all of Israel and they want all the Jews dead. Hamas tells civilians to ignore warnings notices from the Israeli army. That's sweet. Palestinian National and Islamic Forces call on Gaza civilians to act as human shields. We call on them to remain in their homes, however serious the threat may be. Quote, this statement followed Israel's warning to Palestinians who live in the area from which Hamas launches long-range missiles to evacuate their homes to areas of safety before Israel bombed the launching sites. We've talked about this on the podcast before and on videos that we've made. Israel has a policy of doing these knock-knock bombs where they drop a bomb to warn uh, Palestinians and they also call them up on their phones and tell them, get out of your home, we're about to bomb it. Yeah. But Hamas wants to use uh, the civilians as human shields. So, so they tell them to stay yeah, homes. and if they refuse, they, they, they shoot them, basically. Every child you see on the front page of New York Times is murdered by this man and yep. by men like him. And, go. And, the, and the fact that the New York Times says Israeli strikes kill children, that's the New York Times propagating anti-Semitic blood libels just like the Nazis and just like Europeans have been doing for ages talking about Jews killing uh, Christian babies and using the blood for matzah. It's just the modern day version of that. Yep. Hamas song. Fire your uh, rockets. <laughs> blow up Tel Aviv. <laughs> Let's end this with a song. Yeah. And you can find this one also on Spotify. <laughs> Okay, destroy Tel Aviv, right? That's the goal, basically. <laughs> yeah. Holocaust is yeah. what they are after. Uh, they want to kill us all. And this this is before Iron Dome, guys. So, right? So you can see um, why we developed Iron Dome, because Hamas is shooting, was shooting missiles at innocent Israeli civilians 
in order to kill. And if they could, they drop in an, an, an A bomb and kill us all. In a second. And this is why we have Iron Dome. Iron Dome now protects us from those animals, right? And I can't wait to see the Palestinians, uh, like uh, Instagram accounts and commenters, yeah. com like, right? Comment on this video that we're doing right now. Oh, yeah. Free Palestine. It's like, how can you defend? I challenge any one of you to write a coherent, intelligent argument. argument in the comments below how any of this is even nearly acceptable. Right. And that's uh, a little taste of Palestinian TV. Uh, clearly peaceful people, peace-seeking people. I, I quit the podcast, man. I'm not doing this anymore. I'm not doing it. You're going to be a martyr? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, probably. Guys, if you liked what you saw, please subscribe here below. And if you want to support what we do, yeah. go to 200 slash merch and you have two amazing mugs. Nice Jewish boy mug and BDS tears mug. Help us fight those lies and support the show. Yes, yes. You can find us on Spotify. Uh, we have accounts on Instagram, YouTube. Check Only us out. Fans. Only fans, not yet, but we're working on it. We'll be there soon. Uh, tune into the podcast. We hope you enjoyed the video. See you, on the See next you next one. time. Bye.